is Ash here from CurseForever.com and this is my video on how to route the Galaxy Note 2 GT N7100. This method does increase your binary counter. So before we start, let me tell you what the binary counter is and how it affects you. The binary counter is the indicator that proves that you have flashed unauthorized software onto your device and can lead to the loss of warranty. We usually reset this counter using an app called Triangle Away. This is what we did for the S2, the original Note and the Galaxy S3. The developer Chainfire is working on compatibility with the Note 2 and it should be available shortly. But as of today, the 7th of October 2012, there is no way to reset the flash counter. Once Triangle Away is updated, I will annotate it onto the video and add, the, add it to the description as well. The app developer Chainfire is a well respected member of the Samsung Galaxy routing community and uh, I believe that the update, I mean the compatibility issue, the, the app will be made compatible real soon. So I'm going to go ahead and root my device now and I'd suggest you guys to do the same. And one more thing guys, when you root your phone, none of your data, the apps or data will be affected so don't worry about it. So guys, the first thing you need to do is go ahead and get Samsung keys installed and uh, that is available in, from link 1 in the description. So once you've done that, hit link 2 and 3 and download these two files. Guys, now just select Odin, right click it and hit extract here. You will have Odin. And now to open it up, right click and hit run, run as administrator. So now on your Galaxy Note 2, hold the down volume, power and the home buttons at the same time. You might end up taking a screenshot but just keep holding or holding them till you see the screen then you can let it go. Now hit volume up. It would say downloading. Now just connect your phone to the micro USB cable that's connected to your computer. And if you have Samsung keys installed properly, this would turn blue. So guys, by default, the auto reboot and F dot reset time would be the only to check and leave it as it is. So now hit PDA and select the other file that we downloaded that is link 3 that is CWM6 root node2.tar and all you need to do now is hit start. Your Galaxy Note 2 will now reboot. You don't have to do anything guys, it will reboot on its own, just wait for the process to complete. The phone is up. Of going in. You can see that Super SU has been added. Just open it up and hit continue if it asks for it. And then you can leave it. So now your phone has for uh, full root access. So uh, let's go ahead and hold up volume, power and the home keys at the same time. Again you may take a screenshot but don't worry about it, just keep holding it. Till you see Samsung Galaxy Note 2 displayed, then let it go. And there you have it guys, we have clockwork mod based recovery. So you can just hit reboot system now. So that's pretty much it guys when it comes to rooting the Galaxy Note 2 GT N7100. If you guys have any uh, technical questions, hit us up on our forums www.cursefarber.com slash forums. And if you want to stay uh, updated on the latest updates and video releases, hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or Google Plus. All my contact details are in the description and make sure you check out cursefarver.com and if you guys do want to help me out use my links to Amazon in the description uh, if there is anything you want to order online uh, doesn't necessarily have to be Galaxy Note 2 related stuff or smartphone related stuff for that matter just go through my links uh, you'll uh, reach amazon.com just go ahead search for what you want and order it 
every time you guys place an order I tend to make a few cents to a few bucks so if you guys do want to help me out use my Amazon links uh, and uh, that's pretty much it guys before you go uh, make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons I will be coming out with more videos for the Galaxy uh, Note 2 till then thanks a lot for watching guys uh, you have a great day bye bye now